hello there welcome back to coding stuff and in this video we'll see how we can send data between different apps with the help of implicit intent and also we'll talk about uh, the difference between implicit intent and explicit intent so this is the demo app that we'll be creating it's so simple it just have one button and when i click on this send button uh, it shows us the option that can send text so we got a uh, whatsapp messaging chats like instagram uh, gmail true color and all that so i'll click on this gmail so as you can see this hello developers uh, this message i already set it over here means uh, with help of intent we we pass that data between our app to gmail app so yeah uh, let's start to create the app so there are two types of intent uh, explicit and implicit so we use explicit intent uh, when we explicitly name the class of the targeted activity like when we want to navigate from one activity to another activity we use the intent and we pass the class name there but in implicit intent uh, we don't have to specify the class uh, because android uh, helps us to determine an ap appropriate activity to perform or handle that intent so yeah that is the major difference between implicit and explicit in explicit we we specify the class name like the targeted activity but in the implicit intent uh, android takes care of it so yeah so the design uh, we will just need one button so i'll drag it over here constraint it on the both sides and width will be match constraint and we we'll just add some margin from the both sides and let's give it id send button and let's change the text to send then we'll move to our main activity and here first we'll find the id of our button so find the id r dot id dot send button and semicolon then we'll add on click listener to this button so new on click listener and in here we'll create one intent equals to new intent and then we have to set the action with this intent so intent dot set action and this will be intent dot action send because we are sending the data then we'll use a put extra method uh, to send the message between this app to other app so intent dot put extra and here the first parameter will be intent dot extra text and then the data that we want to send so i'll just write here hello developers you can send any data then we have to set the type of the data so our type is text so text and slash pain plain so then we we have to use one if condition to verify uh, if there are some apps which text the data in that mobile where we are running this app so for that we'll use if the intent dot resolve activity this one hit package manager and we'll compare it with null means not null so means if there are some apps then we'll just use start activity method and we'll pass in the intent so yeah that's the uh, necessary code that we need to send our uh, text from one app to another app like you can send uh, any kind of data like uh, you can send images as well like we send images from gallery to whatsapp or something like that so yeah uh, this is simple app we will just send the text so i'll hit on the run button let's see it's working or not so i'll click on this send button and as you can see uh, all the apps that can take the test text are suggested over here so i'll click on the mail and as you can see the message has been retrieved from our put extra method to our gmail so yeah this is how we send the data between two apps so yeah that's it for this video and do subscribe thank you for watching